Hello, Earth citizens. In this video, we'll do a 10-minute routine to change negative thoughts into positive thoughts. Now, I know when you're stuck, especially when you're stuck in a prolonged state of negative thinking, it seems very difficult, darn near impossible to switch your mind from negative to positive thinking. But if I share from my experience, from when I was feeling really negative and pessimistic in the past, when I see from uh, what I went through, I felt like I stayed negative when I didn't take action. I stayed negative when I kept thinking about all these things that are going wrong and thinking about things I need to change, but just sitting idly and not really doing anything except running my mind all the time. Can you relate? So my recommendation for switching negative thoughts to positive thinking is to take action. What kind of action? So first and foremost, let's relate it to what's happening in our world right now. When you turn on the news, when you hear about the things that are going on, it's very easy for someone to fall into negative thinking. Negative thinking about the system, negative thinking about people being oppressed, negative thinking about my situation, negative thinking about just the world in general, feeling hopeless in the society that we live in. So the first question I want to ask you and the first question we will meditate on is what kind of world do you want to create? If you can create the ideal world that will make you happy, healthy, safe and peaceful, what would that be? Many of us want change, but we don't necessarily know clearly what kind of change we want. So let's take some time now to meditate and think about what kind of world do I want to create? So everyone, please sit straight, spine straight, tuck your chin slightly in so you're not sitting like this. Tuck your chin slightly in, rest your hands gently on your knees and close your eyes. Focus your mind in the middle of your chest, your heart. You can feel your breathing. You can feel your lungs going up and down. And now ask your heart, pulling the answer from your heart, not your head. Ask your heart, what kind of world do I want to create? What kind of future do I want? You can get into as many details as you want. If you had a magic wand and you can create the future, what kind of future do you want to create for yourself, your family, your community, and humanity as a whole? Think about that. What does the world that you want to create look like? What expressions do people have on their face? What beliefs drive the society? What are the values that people hold? And what does it look like in your mind when you look around you as you paint your ideal world, ideal future? Can you see a clear image? Or is it still a little unsure and blurry? If you can see a clear image, focus your mind there and keep building on that image with more detail. If you're still not sure, keep focusing on what kind of world, what kind of changes do I want to see? What kind of changes do I want to see? You can let your imagination run wild. Do you have a clear image? Now everyone open your eyes. Were you able to see the future that you wanted to create? Okay. So now if you saw the future you wanted to create, how does it compare to reality? 
The bigger the gap between your ideal future and reality, the bigger we feel hopeless, the more negative thoughts can come out because reality and ideal state is so distant. So now if you don't merge these two together, then you will always stay hopeless and negative and feel powerless to create the changes you want. So the next meditation we will do now are how can we bridge the gap between my reality and my ideal state? The answer to bridge these two worlds is through our actions. Actions. So now we're going to do our second meditation. Close your eyes again. Straighten your spine one more time. Relax your hands on your knees. And bring up in your mind your ideal world again the changes you want to see, how the world looks, what kind of future you want to create. And now as you keep your mind focused on that image, think about what actions, verbs, actions, actions do I need to take that are in line with the future that I want to see. It can be super small, it doesn't have to be big things that change the world, like I need to be president of, the, of a country. It doesn't have to be grand or big. Think of one action. It can be as small as taking out the trash in the morning. Even something like that. One small action that I completely have the power to do that is in line with this future I want to create. Think of many little actions that you can take when you focus on your heart and pull the answer from your heart there are so many things you will realize there are so many things that are totally in your power to create the future that you want so now stay connected to your heart space and think of at least 20 small actions that you have the power to do that is in line with the future you want to create. It can be small, remember. It can be taking out the trash. It can be cleaning my room every day. It can be smiling when I don't feel like smiling. So these are just examples. Think of something that relates to you that is small and completely doable with your own power. Stay focused on your heart. Can you think of some small actions you can take? If you can, keep going, keep thinking. If you cannot, keep imagining the future that you want to create. Stay connected to that image. Keep focusing there. What are some things I can do to create the future I want. Do you have your list? Okay, now open your eyes. How many actions could you come up with? When you really focus on your heart and focus on the image, you can create at least 20 small actions that you have the power to do right now. So the way to switch your mind from negative to positive is not to force your way into mind controlling positivity and happiness, like saying, I'm positive, I'm happy, everything is great. That's not genuine. You don't have to mind control your way into positivity. The most effective way to switch your energy from negative to positive is to take action. 
not big action, small action that go towards creating the future that you want. I'd love to hear some of the positive actions that you came up with. So please let me know in the comments below what's on your to-do list to create the future that you want. You all did a great job. To experience a full one hour brain education based class, please visit a local body and brain yoga studio near you.